Here it is again. I'm going to see if I can scrub out. Oh, come on. Come on. Bumpy road too. They're all freaking bumpy in Brooklyn. What can I tell you? Let's crank this puppy up. Don't forget, Gary. This street has sand on it. So let's leave it right there at four, and we'll see if we can make it home. Shaking up over this whole ride, aren't you? I would be too, but I don't have to sit down onto this stuff. I could stand up <laughs> or take off the seat. I don't want to go that fast. So we're going to bring it down to three. Readjust the mirror, and we will uh, continue on our way. entertaining myself and you guys are watching my videos. How's that? <laughs> yeah. I'm entertaining myself and you guys are watching my videos. All right, I go for the sun. That's all it is. <laughs> Pretty sneaky, huh? Oh, big crow, big crow, big crow. So, uh, as I see it, I'm real close to home. Pass, pass the golf course. I think I'm losing my left, my right ear, bud. still there, but it's very faint, I think. There's just not much going on there. That's so anyway. Well, this is 
becoming a nightly ride with me. I kind of like uh, going on these 10, 12 mile jaunts late afternoon. Oh, I'm a happy boy. <laughs> I'm a happy boy. How many other husbands can jump, jump out and get on their bicycle and get fucked up? Well, a lot of them dry. They're just not out in there. Yeah, I am losing my ear, bud. Hang on, we're going here. Oh, this place here is doing a lot of business. All right, hang on. We're going to push this ear, bud, in. In fact, we're going to lick it. When you lick the ear, but it gives it a little bit more suction. Yeah, it's a little better. Alright, we'll go with that. Because here comes some metal. Oh, baby, it sure is. Hang on to yourselves. Oh, more skidding in the dirt. Deep plane, deep plane. I didn't even look up, did I? I didn't see anything. So they didn't look up. Yeah, I never saw nothing. <laughs> I don't look for planes, I look just for helicopters. Or strange aircraft, I should say. I'd like to see those Delta jet wing jets again. And I'd like to see a uh, Galaxy Cargo. They fly by every once in a while, and you got to be quick. They're doing a buck and a half. you got to be quick. You hear them, they're gone. And they fly nice and low, too. That's why I only get helicopters. They're, uh, they're fine. What I gotta do is, I gotta figure out something. I keep my camera, my, my SLR, on tripod uh, next to me in my chair. So that if I do hear a helicopter, I can jump out the front porch and take a video, which is my SLR, I can get a zoom on it and get more, uh, more view of what uh, I'm looking for, or looking at, and I got a helicopter the other day and I just couldn't keep the camera still. Once you start putting a zoom on a camera, it's tough keeping that thing still because you need a tripod or something with a with an automatic zoom or with a also a motor on it to turn it just perfect. Because usually uh, it bounces around, and I'm not an artiste that camera eyes it either. I have such a stock video camera that uh, it takes excellent, excellent videos and very easy to uh, maintain and handle. Pocket right there all the time. I better take a cord for my tunes, because I'm going to bring my tunes. I'll take a cord so I can hook it up to a USB. Uh, most, most airports have a USB if I need it. I doubt I'll even need it, but I'll have to plug it in at errands anyway before I leave. And I also have to bring my password to YouTube so that I can upload videos at least into my file. Damn, what's my... How do I get in my front page?
Yeah, I'll have to know that if I want to upload any videos because it's uh, <laughs> going to be a lot of videos for a week. A week! Jared and I are going down to see my kid, <laughs> our kid, uh, at the end of this month for a week. Uh, she's moving. And we're gonna help, we're gonna help her move small tiny boxes because she got she hired some movers to take the big stuff. And she's uh, since it's closing, I guess she would like us to be there for that. And of course, I like stuff like that because what do you do after you go to a shindig like that? go out and you have a nice dinner and a drink. Ooh, what do they do here? You have a nice dinner and a drink. That's what you do. And that's what I'm going to do. <laughs> Hopefully. I'm pretty sure that's what we're going to do. Uh, shit, well, seven days? I guarantee you I at least go out seven times. Yep, at least once a day. Maybe even twice in one day. You know, breakfast and then late supper or early supper. You know, I'll bring some money.
Hi. You, you own the home? Uh, no, my husband does. Oh, uh, I'm having my siding done next okay. month. Good. How'd it work out, all right? Yeah. Good. Thank you. got burnt and I didn't have a clue I did not have a clue so there were two or three trucks over there one day they asked Sharon what the hell's going on over there is somebody moving again they just moved in no remember the fire they had two weeks ago <laughs> no <laughs> I know there was sirens everywhere and I don't hear the ones next door Somebody screaming? Nope. Thank you. He's barking now, but when he's behind the car, he won't bark. Until he sees me again. <laughs> you got it, narwhal. All right, Gary, come on. Pedal. You're getting low gear. It's taking me. Voila. Seven... 793. 12 miles today. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no, it shuts itself off every time I shut the thing off. I, every time I shut the uh, speedometer off, it shuts off. So 793. All right, we're home, peoples. Later.